this gadget it's called a wah wah pedal I decided to make a quite a quick video about it just to try and explain basically what it is because uh, I know from my own experience when I started learning electric guitar, this, this is an electric guitar gadget the, the, the effect of wah wah, it's one of many effects but it's something I found really confusing because I was listening to stuff and thinking how the heck do you make a guitar sound like that until I realised what they were actually doing so this thing's called a wah wah pedal I'm going to explain it in more detail later I'll show you the video first and I'll talk about it because I think it'll make more sense that way the reason I've decided to uh, to do this is uh, if you're familiar with my channel you'll know that I'm, I'm relatively new to uh, producing these videos and one of the things that I've learned apart from the music side of things is that producing and editing videos takes up a tremendous amount of space on the computer so I've actually reached a point recently where I've had to try and clear a little bit of space and get rid of some stuff so I can continue making these things I think I'll probably have to think about upgrading the computer at some point but anyway blah 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 so I went through some old videos uh, trying to sort of delete get rid of things that I could just clear some space of I found an old video of myself playing something that I was using a wah wah pedal on so I'm going to I'm going to show that now it's not a brilliant performance I'd say it's a slightly older video it's one of the <clears throat> videos I did during the, the lockdown period I was just sort of coming home from work have a shower, have a tea and just perform a quick song just to do something to keep my mates entertained so it's, the performance isn't fantastic it's alright um, and I do look a little bit silly because I dressed up with the sunglasses like the the original player of the, the song I was trying to replicate so it's a little bit of fun I don't mind sharing it um, I, I don't care that it's not perfect because the reason I'm I'm sharing this at this point is just to demonstrate the, the sound that this thing makes and when I watch the video back deciding whether do I want to get rid of it or can I use it I thought it's, a it's quite a good example of being able to hear the difference between the sounds in the video it's only about a minute long I play about the first half of it, about the first 25 seconds just normally on the electric guitar and then I think at about 25 or 27 seconds or there rounds I start using the wah wah pedal and you can clearly hear the effect that this thing has so I'm going to, I'm going to play that now and then after that once you've had a chance to have a listen to it so you can hear for yourself what the, the difference in sound is I'll uh, explain a little bit more about what this thing does So this is the thing that I was using to uh, produce that that sound, that effect that you will have heard, like, as I say, about 25 seconds into to that video. It's it's an effects pedal. There's many different effects pedals you can get for guitar. This is one of them. The reason it's called a pedal, first of all, is because it's operated with your foot, just like a bicycle pedal. Obviously, when you're playing guitar, you need both hands, one to strum with, one to fret your notes with. So you really don't have an opportunity to be able to adjust your sound using your hands so with a with a pedal of any kind a guitar effects pedal it's something that you uh, you operate with your feet most normal pedals you switch them on or switch them off so you could play for a while on a let's say for example 
a clean sound that sounds like an acoustic guitar I could switch on an effects pedal to give a distorted or an overdrive sound make it sound like a heavy heavy metal electric guitar that's like an on-off pedal this one's slightly different, the wah wah pedal because although I do switch it on and off uh, you, might, you might have seen in my video I actually fluffed it trying to switch it on I had to do it twice because basically because I was sat down and these are normally designed to be used stood up so I didn't manage to get enough weight on the switch there's a switch inside it to switch the thing on and off to enable this or disable it from working but once I switched it on it's not just a thing that is on or off it's actually if you can see it rocks up and down like that so depending on the angle of my foot on that paddle it's all the way down, all the way up or anywhere in between I can move that anywhere I want to with my foot what that does it adjusts the tone of my sounds so really basic explanation it's slightly more complex but on your electric guitar you've got normally a, a volume control and a, a tone control I've mentioned that in another video I'll put a link in for that one but because you've only got two hands you can't really be playing whilst adjusting your tone control so this really is adjusting the tone of your, your of the guitar sound it, it doesn't really or it shouldn't really affect the volume you can change the settings on, on this actual one to create a little bit more volume if you want to but that's not the idea, it's, it's to adjust the tone and it gives a really characteristic sound, hopefully you heard it in the video um, to, to try and uh, explain it in a I think they call it onomatopoeic way where you explain it with your voice it's a little bit like making a sound where you open and close your mouth um, wow 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 that's where the name wow wow that's where the name comes from you probably often see a lot of players that use these when they're performing live they kind of they move in that mouth the mouth in the shape because it's they get the feel of the the, the sound they're making so that's a wow wow pedal um, it's one of the ones that's really if you've, if you've never heard of them and you don't know what they do it's a little bit of a mystery to understand how a guitar player might make the guitar sound that particular way if, you, if you're not familiar with the equipment they're using to do that but it's it's fairly a straightforward thing it's normally a as I say it's, it's a tone control I've got um, a socket on here I plug my guitar into another socket out here goes into my amplifier um, and as with many of these effects pedals I can either put a little battery in it underneath or I can use a, a power supply to power it because it does need some kind of a power supply so the video wasn't a fantastic performance, it was a quick one I did but I think it showed the the use of the effect quite well even if my playing wasn't absolutely on point so all I was trying to do was uh, demonstrate the effect I'll probably do another video where you can actually see me using it up and down and compare that to the the sound that's coming out of the guitar but basically when the when the pedal's in that position it's like your tone control is lowered so it's a little bit more muddier and, and not as in your face when it's down like that it's a lot more sharper and up front so the wah wah pedal